Tammy, Tammy. Hello, 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 everyone. <laughs> yeah, I'm late. I had an appointment and then um, I knew I was going to be running late, but I told Jim I would bring us lunch home. So I did that. And here I am. And I had to stop and talk to Nellie, my sister-in-law, on the way down. So how are you, Tam? Have you heard anything? What are we doing tomorrow? I am. I'm going to go ahead and lower my camera. Hang on. Um, change cameras. Oh, well, I have to plug it in first. I'm glad I had everything else ready. Thank you for being patient with me. Okay. So now I should be able to switch this to that. Ta-da! You can move it down some. There. Oh, okay. She's probably busy doing something. Oh, I don't have my phone. I was going to show you guys. Do I really not have my phone? Nope. Oh, well. All's good. All's good. I'm going to show you the Christmas card I'm going to make out of the set. But we will do that next week. We will actually make the card next week. Okay, I'm going to eat one French fry and then I'll put them up. Yes, we're eating junk today. I appreciate you being here, Tammy. So, I just want to show you this set. Okay, done with my fry. I, I was not interested in this at all. Not at all. I mean, I like the watercolor look. It's kind of whimsical. But I wasn't really interested in it until I seen a card from this. So cute. And let's just open this up. So this is called Decorated with Happiness. Glasses need to go on. And I think I'm going to end up using this a lot. It's number 159704. There's 14 stamps. Um, sentiments are wishing you a season decorated with happiness and wonder, boughs of jolly, and Christmas greetings. So, and it's the photopolymer, and the, it is kind of a watercolor look. If you can see this here. So, and then it has, um, like, the little scribble marks, which I love those. There's another one. Okay, so there's that. And then along with that is the pine dies. And I haven't even, I just got these last night, so. And I am an independent stamping up demonstrator. My website is right there in that blue box, pennypudge.stampingup.net, in case you're interested in purchasing anything. Otherwise, just hang out with us. Um, you're welcome to give me a thumbs up if you would, and even leave a comment. Would be great. I'm just going to bring YouTube up and see how far behind okay good so let me move my stream yard right here over here okay 
yeah i like i like this and it's like i said it's a good size see look at that look how big it is it's large and then i like this too okay so the dies like i said are decorated pines it's item number one five nine seven ten and there's 21 dies in this so so you're gonna have to stay in suspense and next week we will make the card because i want to open my paper pumpkin i haven't even opened it yet okay so once again I will switch this out like that. This will go on and look at them all. So there is, isn't that cool? I really like this. Yes, I know which one you're with the pine cone. Is that what you're talking about, Tammy? She said it reminds me of a card we did years ago. And then we had some with ornaments too. So then here's just this, the um, bow and the string. So this will be fun. Stars. And I like these little ones here. Here's some more stars. Oh, and then this is like, it's so tiny. Can you see it? Here. Let's put it on that. So you can use that for like a tiny, tiny, tiny tag, or I'm sure it's for um, the ornaments. It's a little. Hey, Lori B. Yeah, you can play with this set. Okay. So there's that. And so I just want to take this i suppose so i just noticed this one you see this one with the circle in the center and i think it's this one so i suppose you could stamp it you could stamp it oh that's so hard to see and then you could stamp oh i have my cords all tangled sorry Come on, cords. Back there. Okay. And then you could um, cut out on this one just a different center, different color. See the middle? Lori B., I hope you're doing well. Okay, so I'm just showing the stamp set. Next week, we will make a card because this is what I want to do my Christmas cards from. Actually, I don't want that in there. Close this up. And this is what I do on my sets is I will put decorated with happiness on the dot, back of the die. So I know that that is the stamp set it goes to. Okay. And then I'm going to, so I have the number on this side. I'm going to put this, I like them this way. Oh, I'm shaking you guys, sorry. Just holler at me when I do that. Okay, and then on this, I am going to put decorated pines on the back. Okay, and then a lot of times I'll put the year, not always. Because I don't keep my catalogs anymore, and I'm sure 
some of those diehard Stampin' Up! demonstrators will yell at me, but it is what it is. Okay, then I got this to go with it. It's called Stamping Cut and Emboss, and they're embossing folders. They're the um, chubbier ones, and that is what they look like. So the card I want to make, I uses the pine, whoops, hang on, the pine boughs. Okay, so look at them. I love those pine boughs. And then here's the snowflakes with swirls. More whimsical look, more realistic look. And they're just small ones. See? They are only three, a little over three and a quarter by six and an eight. The design so I didn't even notice these in the catalog they're in the um, seasonal catalog until I seen this card on Pinterest or someplace wherever I've seen it at so I want to keep this in there did I give you the item number this item number is 155433. And I do have a hostess code in the description box too. If you do place an order, you can use that hostess code. It's still celebration time through the end of August. I suppose I should show you my catalogs. We'll do that real quick before we look at paper. So here's the annual catalog. This is the mini catalog. That is our, it runs from July through the end of the year. And this one runs until May, nope, April. And then the celebration is um, two categories. Purchase $50 before taxes and shipping. Or purchase a hundred before taxes and shipping and there's free items in here that you are eligible for plus as a hostess and if your party um, is a certain amount you get hang on the stamp set right there free absolutely free Okay, so there's those. Now I want to show you the ribbon I got to go with. This is the um, open weave ribbon, 3 8 inch. There's 10 yards. And I'm looking for an item number. This is soft succulent, 155780. Yeah, I just do it because in that way, in case, because I store them together, you know, like I'll store them um, right next to each other on my shelves here. But just in case I grab the stamp or the die and not with each other, then I know where it belongs at because they're not, they don't have the same name usually. See, decorated with happiness. And this is the pine dies. Really? See? I mean, it's not even similar. Look at this ribbon, you guys. Hmm. I don't know what I want to put it on. There. I think you can see it there. Pretty, pretty, pretty. I love it. So this will be part of my Christmas card. All right. So I'm going to set those aside and show you some paper. I don't know why I started doing that cami writing on them, but I guess maybe because 
I would have to go look in the catalog and see what went with what, where that's still super shiny. Oh, you don't want to see all my writing. That's just to cover up that spot right there. Okay. So this is called Lights Aglow, and it goes as part of a suite with another set in the catalog. And it's six by six papers. There are 48 of them total. So this has the gold shimmer. Oh, yeah, you can see it. Yeah. Ooh, look at there. I love that. There's a name for this. Boko something like that. So there are four pieces of the same design. There's that, which has that in it. Let's see? There's the back, black and white. Almost looks like um, cross stitching with an extra in there. Hi, Cynthia. Welcome, welcome. Yes, you are. I met you last night. Everyone say hi to Cynthia. Yes, we were on Tammy Pan Passion's channel last night visiting. Cynthia is great. She helps Tammy out a lot. Okay, there's that one. I'm just showing some paper. That's pretty. It's hard to describe, but like this design is, um, let's see if you can see it. Little bitty stars, that cross hatchy thing, little tiny circles, a little tiny bit bigger circles is what makes up that design. Oh, yeah, there. Much better. Very pretty. Oh, I didn't show you the back of it. I love stars for Christmas. I'm glad this has a lot of stars in it. So here's your soft succulent color. Okay, what's this called? Boko? This design with the different circles. It's going to drive me crazy. I'm going to have to look it up here in a bit. Oh, yeah. Look at there. All of this has just a little touch of shimmer. Well, most of it, not all of it. But hang on. I want to get that there. And. Yeah, I love the stars for Christmas. All right. There's this. So those colors there. Well, there you go. B-O-K-E-H. Yes, I have a stamp set like that too. Yes, this one is snowflakes. But, yeah, this is snowflakes. Those are stars. But it's this. It, hang on. This design here, Cynthia. I don't know how. Bo, Boca dots. Hi, Cheryl. Was that CS? <laughs> hang on. Let me look. This one? These are all Stampin' Up! papers. And it does kind of look like a tree. Cardstock, you got it, yes. And it is real, it's not like real super thick, but it's nice cardstock. 
it's designer series paper from stamping up is what it is so it's like very lightweight cardstock or very heavy paper um this cheryl is called lights a glow and they're six by six papers you get 48 there's four of each design it's item number one five nine five three five that was hard because they didn't have my glasses on so i just read it to you let me um go up here real quick and i'll finish showing you stamping up Um, and I'll get you the link. Now, if you have a demonstrator, I would like you to shop through them. One, five, nine, five, three, five. One, five, nine, thirty-five. Right there. So there's a link on my website. Let me get back here and say hi to Cheryl. So there's a link on my website. Just copy and paste. Or I think I think you can click on that. All right, let me finish. So there's that. Yeah, this is cute. That has the gold on it. And it has the bokeh, however you say it, in the background, too. Thanks, guys, for joining me. Thumbs up if you would. Oh, look at this one. This is pretty. So I'll probably have to... Um, Cheryl, all my information is down in the description box. And if you do order from me, uh, I have a July workshop hostess code there. And it will ask you if it's associated with a host or a party. So Penny Pudge would be the demonstrator and the hostess. Thanks, Cheryl. Look at that. Isn't it pretty? Can you guys see? I don't think you can see the sparkle, but it's there. That's also, okay, on YouTube, I'm seeing it like white and gold with the green, but it is green and the rest of it's all gold. I don't know how you guys are seeing it. There's some more of that. Okay, so let's see this one. Ooh, yeah. Ah. Yeah, it's hard to keep up with everything, Cheryl. And I have so much, so much that I have been selling some of it. And um, I will probably be doing a live sale again here in a week or so with stamp bean products for sale so there's that red and these are pretty colors um so basic black this is cherry cobbler in my hand evening evergreen and the soft succulent and then very vanilla so this is the back Ooh, look at that. Okay. Then, there's this one. So, there was a green one just like this, too. So, those are the basic colors. Oh, well, this was not the one I meant to grab, but hang on. Hang on, it's right here. 
face there, see? And so then that's your back. Oh, so the backs are different though. But that's the same. Different color. Okay. And one more. So there's this one, the frame one in red. All right. So that's called Lights Aglow. Yeah, if you order off the website, it is shipped directly to you. So, um, and I'm not closing this for a while. Probably the middle of the month. But if you order, yours will be sent to you right away. So this was a free item in the celebration catalog, which is going on now. Tammy, I'm using your catalog. So it's right here. It was free with a $50 order. If this is what I chose, so that's what I chose. So we'll just flip through here and then we're going to do paper pumpkin real quick. Yeah. Okay, these are all just one-sided cards. Mm, they're paper. They call them paper. So it's the gold. There are again. Oh, there's six of these. So that would be fun. You make several cards of the same. There's the gold little um, polka dots, but they're not circular. They're more oblong. And then here is the silver with the lines. And the silver in snowfall i'll call it snowfall so these are fo foil just so you know not the white but the um the silver and the gold on them so i got that free okay i'm gonna put this back in the pack because we were talking this morning on my live about how some of us put things away and some of us don't okay so cheryl i put that link oh for the tree paper yeah so i put that link right above here let me see if you click on it that is the paper so the tree one is on top There's that one second from the end, or there's another tree one. See, I wish I had my phone with me, and I don't. There's another tree one third on the bottom. So if you click that link, it should just pop right up that. Okay, I'm putting this away. And then this afternoon, I need to finish my invoices so I can get my things all ready to send to you who ordered from, my, from the cell that we had on Becky's. Okay, here we go. This was last month's Paper Pumpkin. And what Paper Pumpkin is, is a kit. And it's paperpumpkin.com. Hang on. I don't have a sharp item. Like I said, I have not even opened this. And I've, I've had this for a while, but because I had not felt well, it did not get opened. And I thought, well, let's just do it here. It's called Sending Good Thoughts. It's the July 2022 Paper Pumpkin. So, yeah, just click on that link, Cheryl. So, what I do with, whoops. I got my mess. Um, 
let me find you the info. So once again, here, we'll just go do it. I am going to click on this in my website. And it will direct you to the paper pumpkin um, website sometimes, but then, then I don't get credit for it. So you need to make sure you're still on my website when you do it. So you could type in paperpumpkin.com, but then I would not get credit for it. So they have prepaid paper pumpkin subscription for one month, three months, six months. Hang on. So the one month is now yeah, Oh, I lost it. Hang on. Okay. One month. Okay, now I'm going to send this to you. It's $22.50. It is a fully designed project kit. Will arrive with stamps, ink, and paper. Everything ready to go so you can skip to the fun part of crafting. So I'll show you this one and just they're different every month. Okay, so let me just copy this link. And anytime you guys have any questions, you are welcome just to let me know. Cheryl says, hi, everybody. So there's the one month. It also comes in, but you can search for it once you are... See, I'm not sure I still on my website. I think it see that's what I'm saying. I think it sent me to, but let me find out. Okay, here is the six month. It's $122.50. I'm gonna add it to my cart. I'm gonna view my cart. And you can go in the website after you ordered it. And, and so like if you would order your paper pumpkin now, you would even be eligible to get like on this one, two fifty dollars free things or one $100 free things. Um, so if I'm going to check out. Yeah, it's not. This is interesting because, see, it's not on my web page anymore, which it should be. Hello, Laura Kai. Okay, let me figure this out. really quick okay i'm gonna go back here there i am i'm gonna shop now so i went to pennypudge.stampingup.net hmm. yeah it doesn't say shopping with penny and it should so I think when you check out, hopefully it will say that. If not, let me know and we'll get it figured out. All right, I'm back with you guys. Laura, how are you? All right, so they have different, and you can go in, what I'm saying is you can go in after you've ordered to their website and, and they do now tell you, show you what you're getting each month prior to the 10th of the month. And so if you choose you don't want that one, then you just click like you hold the subscription. But it is nice because everything's there. And what's really super nice is like taking it with you somewhere. And Tammy says, paper pumpkins are so fun. Nice to get a surprise in the mail. 
Also, YouTube has several alternative ways to make cards using that month's kit. And not just cards, but other things too, like little goodie bags or whatever. So this again is the July 2022 Sending Good Thoughts. Laura, I haven't seen you around for a while. And again, it's telling me about celebration, which goes to the end of the month. And the other thing, Stampin' Up! does have their own card kits too. And if you go onto my website, pennypudge.stampingup.net, and when it says shop now, the drop down, you can go to kits and it will show those to you. All right. So it comes packaged. This is sending good thoughts. So it's kind of a nautical theme. It'll show you there what they are. Ooh, it's raining hard there, Laura says. Yes, we had a nice rain the other morning. They each come with a stamp set. So this is your nauticals. So there's ship. This looks like, oh, where's the glasses? There's a seahorse. Oh, wow, look at there. You can see it much better. There's a treasure map, starfish, or stars. Sending good thoughts is a sentiment. Thinking of you, can't wait to see you. And it is S-E-E, -E, not S-E-A. <laughs> Wishing you all the best. So there's some seaweed, the seahorse. Those are just little splotchies. So we'll go ahead and open this kit. So that you can see they package them very nicely. And then they each have just a little ink dot here. And usually if it's your first time, they also include a little acrylic block. So literally you have, you don't have scissors in here, but other than that, and most of these are um, perforated or punch out. So you really, most of them you don't need scissors for. Laura Kai says, oh, Sandy, I didn't see you sneak in. Deep in paper and glue. Good for you, Sandy. Woohoo. Everyone say hi to Sandy, to Big Mama. Tornado up where my son lives in New York, Washington County. Ooh. Laura says, I know I was song bits, Laura C, the other day. People get it mixed up with me. I did that uh, at the cell, Laura. Somewhere. Because I thought you wanted C. Oh, I was modding for Becky, I think. Um, I knew you wanted, I thought you wanted C, but it was just Laura C. So, <laughs> so I'm the, I was one. I'm guilty. To get it mixed up. Yep, see? You're trying to live or you're trying to live, Laura. There's a huge difference. I need to know which one. Thanks. Laura saying hi to everyone. Yes, me too. Like I made this morning. But since this is stamping up, I, I won't show you. Just go back and watch my morning live. Ooh, paper beads. Yay. <laughs> well, I did do that. Very distinctly, I did that. Big Mama saying hi. All right, so this also comes with some dimensionals. So these are the stickies that raise your project, your paper off from the base. So if you see their foam and they're sticky. I want you there. I think you can see it good. 
This one also has some little glue dots. Make sure that's what those are. Yep, little glue dots and some twine. But it's soft thread. It's not like um, rough. I shouldn't say that because I didn't feel it, but I'm. it looks like it. Laura Bluegrass. There you go. I have been croaking online with some new folks. Oh, fun. Sandy, you make my heart smile, too. You're a dear woman. My hands look awful. I have been, while well, I was down here, I had a bunch of coffee that was um, needing something done with it, so I didn't waste it. Yes, it's soft. So it's a fiber. And so I had been coffee's dying. Oh, and I had some tea too that needed used. Um, paper. Lots of my muslin. And the four inch rose lace. If any of you were at the sale, I tea dyed some of the last of that. Or coffee stained it. So I'll show you that another time, but yeah. All right, in here are the directions right there. Step by step, I am not seeing, I don't think I'm gonna make one today, but. So here's card number one. Card number two, card number one, card number two, card number three. So it shows you, like, here is your block. This is your acrylic block. That's your first piece. Shows you where to stamp it. And, of course, you use this Bermuda Bay or whatever color you want. So it shows you exactly what to do. We have done one of these before. <clears throat> Not this specific one. Oh, have you been called that before, Sandy? Yeah, I like bluegrass too. Oh, I don't know that I've ever done that to you, Lori B. I've just always called you Lori B, but I guess because I knew you were Lori B. And then Laura Kai, you used to just go by Laura Kai, correct? Uh, I bet they love it, Sandy. So let's see what this kit has. It has... Envelopes, three, six, nine envelopes, white on the inside. It has card bases. There's, um, I think that's Fresh Freesia. There's three of those. Ooh, look at them bottles, you guys. Love those. Hang on. There's Smoky Slate, it looks like. Oh, and so they have these in between for each one. Okay. So that's, there's two sheets, three sheets of the coral, seaweed, seagull, starfish. There's three sheets of that. Then this one, our banners and circles, and then just like a little plate here. And then this one has the bottles and the big banner. Those are cool. I like those. Almost looks like chalk rubbed on it. 
And these are, so there's three sheets of this. So I'm sure this goes on like your base. I'm sure there's a picture somewhere. It'd be easier if I did that. Yes. And then here's with the ocean clouds up in the sky. Oh, there you can see that. You got beads on the brain, and then here's just waves. So this tells me everything that is in it right there. It shows. And then there's your finished ones. And sometimes they'll have like kits that you can buy at a discounted price, but you have to be a Paper Pumpkin subscriber. So that's fun. If you like the beachy nautical theme. Okay. So that's the new Paper Pumpkin, and that is all about Paper Pumpkin. So um, one, one month three months, six months, and I think even a year is available to subscribe to it. And everything's right here. And like I said, so you see these were all punch, they're all punch outs. So you don't even need scissors. The only thing you would need scissors for is the twine. And someone around you might have a jackknife you could use just to cut your twine. Ooh, did you see that, Laura? Check out Nick the Booksmith's new video on paper beads. All right, I'm not putting it back in there, but I am putting this. Okay, look at here. Hang on. Here is, this is pretty, for stock, sunflowers. And it says, free gift for subscribers, Sweet Sunflowers Paper Pumpkin Kit. Get ready for a softly serene watercolor sunflower in a sophisticated and stylish color palette with Sweet Sunflowers Paper Pumpkin Kit. This kit is filled with special techniques, printed die cut pieces, fun embellishments, and two stamping ink spots. So this is the stamping ink spot. So that would be your free gift is the extra ink spot. You will not want to miss out on this creative masterpiece. Make sure you subscribe to Paper Pumpkin by August 10th to get yours. And there's a picture of it. I like that. But I like watercolor. I have paper beaded necklaces, but I've never made them myself. My daughter... I think gave me one, and I don't know if she, where she made it at when she was very little. And these are nice, sturdy boxes, so like you can use them for storage. Okay, hey everyone. There's that paper, and next week we will make my um, Christmas card. That's my name. I don't want. So if you have any questions, you can get a hold of me on my Facebook page, Penny Pudge, or my, um, yes, just, or my email, pennypudgestamps at gmail.com. So any of those would be great. Look at, I put that there and then you can't even see it. And hang on, hang on, there's more. Just for those of you who weren't here to begin with. There's the decorated with happiness stamp set. And the decorated pine dies right there. And then I love these embossing folders. Here, we'll do this. A succulent ribbon. 
So there's goodies there, everyone. Yes, it is pretty paper. Very pretty. I showed it early so you can go back and watch, Sandy, what you missed. And here's the Boko. Oh, I'm going to have to Google how you say that. Because I know, I think it's like bro, bro, go. I don't know. Well, it's on that, but here, there, look at there. That right there, technique. <laughs> well, don't get it if you can't afford it or unless you truly, truly want it. That's what I say. And what do I tell all my friends? Use what you have or you end up like me with too much and it becomes overwhelming sometimes. Oh, I loved what I did this morning. And so my goal is to get all my invoices done so that I can clean up here. So tomorrow, if some of my friends come over, then I can just play. <laughs> oh, there's so much paper, Sandy. I'll bet you have paper. I'll bet you have some paper. And I have a little box to go out to you, Sandy. I don't know if you can use any of it, but. <laughs> Let's do this one. Lord Kai says, I have enough and overwhelmed. Nice to use for a while. Feels free. It does. I agree with you, Laura. I know um, I have shown in the past too, like my little, my boxes, they're not little, uh, scraps. So as soon as I get this stuff halfway organized, those boxes, I'm going to make some master boards, I think, out of those. And I have, I have all kinds and I have lots of stamping up scraps and because like just this morning, like with what I did, then I had to package it all up. See, here it is. Because um, then I'm not going to work on it until after I get the stuff cleaned up. So. Ooh, it, it's coming, Sandy. I don't have yours packaged yet. I have everything cut. Um, everything in groups and I did actually take about six six packages to the post office today that I can now put shipping amount on <laughs> right Sandy <laughs> bye everybody I better go because I Hang on. I, um, I love leaves too. Actually, a lot of my decor when we, eh, when we painted many years ago, stem from leaves. Yep. Okay, sweet friends, thumbs up if you would, please. And I'm sure I'll see you around. Tam, let me know what you girls decide. And if you guys have any questions, please reach out. Even if you already have a demonstrator, I'm happy to answer any questions I can for you. Have a great rest of your afternoon. And I, I'm sure there's a couple sales tonight. So I'm sure you're welcome, Cheryl. Cheryl, thanks so much for stopping by. All of you, I appreciate it very much. And most days I would just sit here and hang out with you. But today I want to get these things done so that you guys who have ordered from me can get your packages. Be a blessing to someone. Thank you. Bye-bye.